Okay, hello guys to my first video on this channel. So in this video I'm going to talk about um, the integration of PancakeSwap into your own DEX. So if you want to create your DEX but you don't know how to do the, the swapping, the staking, the adding liquidity and stuff, then I'm going to show you in this course. So what we're going to do is we will uh, first initialize the project, then we will take um, the contract from PancakeSwap, so what we need from PancakeSwap. Um, we will do some tests um, and then run some scripts. And after that, um, I will also try to do a dump front-end, uh, not gonna dive too deep into designing because I'm very bad at design. Um, we are going to do a front end and also integrate our smart contracts into it. So let's start. So we first need to initialize our project with npm init. Enter. Enter to everything. Good. Now let's switch here and try to initialize our hard hat, right? So after we run npm init, we need to run npm install, um, save the hard hat. Let's clear this, paste this here, and just let it install. Okay, so hard hat is installed. Now we just need to run it. So npx hard hat. We will need a basic temple project. Okay, yes, um, yes. It will install some dependencies that we will need. And let's just wait. All right, so everything is done now. The hardhead project is initialized, and we will clear this terminal. Okay, so we see that we have the greeter contract, we have the scripts and the tests, and yeah, we are good to go, guys. We are now on PancakeSwap um, organization on GitHub. We will need to go to the PancakeSwap periphery uh, repository, click into contracts, click into interfaces, and we will use yeah we don't need to use the the pancake router 02 but because so this is the the version 2 of the first router it has some new functions uh we won't use the new functions because they are not so relevant but um for the sake of it let's just uh, let's just use the the newer version right so we will copy the, the pancake router too. We will go into our contract. Uh, you will need to create um, your contract. I just uh, named it my exchange and oops, okay, so for some reason this doesn't work. Let's just do it like this. And there we go, we have the interface. And we see that this interface also requires the the, the first version uh, interface, right? So the pancake router 01. So we will delete this import statement because uh, we will get this interface and we will place it in the same file here. So we now have both interfaces here and they are good to go and use. 